Spiritual Leo is back with another reading. This reading is for the collective, of course. Um, but I'm going to go back to doing zodiac signs. I'm going to do both. Um, then that way I can kind of narrow down the energies a little bit and just give everybody their own like separate reading to give more clarity to people so um i'm gonna start that next week um or probably the end of this week i will start i'll start off with aries and go from there and still do my collective so but let's get into it i hope you had a good day i hope things are well to my angels my guys my ascended masters the divine the universe the higher power Archangel Michael, Archangel Michael, Raphael, Jophiel, Gabriel, Uriel, Metatron, Azarel, and to my ancestors that love and care for me and want the best for me, please and thank you for the clear, precise, accurate messages that I need to deliver to the collective at this time. Let's get it. Alrighty then. So the song that I, the channel song that I got was um, Sade, this um, No Ordinary Love. And there's a part when she said, um, love like that won't last, um, gave you, oh my God. Now, why would I write it where I can't read it? I'm just going to play it. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> Let's see. All right, the intro. So let's just, let me pick some cards here. I'm going to get three cards. You are the love I got. I gave you more than I could give. Gave you love. That's what I didn't know what it was. I gave you all that I have inside. And you took my love. You took my love. And then as I'm saying that, taken. <laughs> All I can leave. Somebody said that a love like that won't last. Multiple options. Ten of cups. And walk away. Okay. So the vibe that I was getting from the song um, is that there was like a twin flame or soulmate life partner union here that um someone had to walk away from and this wasn't no ordinary love and i feel like it might have been some outside interference here to cause us she's saying i keep crying oh that's that part was i keep trying for you this could have been an in and out relationship where you really try to make things work with this person and it's because there's a bond here. Um, it's a soulmate, I feel, life partner bond or a twin flame. And um, it kind of like devastated you or really broke you to have to walk away from this person. But there was something else going on here. And I feel like now there's a new person trying to come towards you in the spiritual realm first. But this person is going through hell to try to get to you. And it's because, and then she's here with bars at the door and she has a wedding dress on. This person trying to come towards you is a fighter, but they going through a lot of battles to get to you. I feel like there's like karmics they're fighting, karmic energies that's still holding on to you. Um, in, in the spiritual realm or energetically, they're still trying to hold on to you. Then there's this ex person that's a voided contract here with this person. So we have someone here that's really fighting for your love in the spiritual realm. And that's why things are moving so slowly with this person coming towards you because they have a lot of battles that they're fighting their own battles on top of trying to get to you oh my god my ancestors through all these cards so let's get into it um i got like a sad feeling um because there was love here for this past person um hold on y'all i'm feeling like i shouldn't be using these cards 
Let me, let me see what I get here. I keep flying, I'm falling. I feel like you fell in love with this person. Yeah, we have the Ten of Swords here. There was definitely deceit here, betrayal, backstabbing. I feel like you really tried. I'm sorry, I'm switching the cards the way they're supposed to be. I feel like you really tried and it just it just became too much for you. But I, I think you knew who this person was to you, but this person didn't know how deep this relationship really is here was page of wands here it might have been deception this person going towards uh, Jezebel or karmic energy here yeah their their passion or one night stand because it's a page of wands so it's not like full on passion I feel like they they went towards someone on some impulsive lusty decision they made and it caused the ending here with the death card um contract voided is what i heard we have the moon card i could be talking about a cancer or or scorpio or you could be that could be your sign but there was a lot of things hidden with this person um Six of Pentacles, they was given to others. Yep, Three of Cups here. This person still has a hold on you energetically. It's like they won't get out the way for other options to come in. So I don't know if you've been having an issue with dating after this person. Because it's like an energetic, energetic hold on you. It's like we have the Eight of Pentacles here. Yeah, you, your light was really dimmed here. It's in reverse. This is my vibrant aura is just out of this world, blinding to others. It's in reverse. So this took some, I said this kind of was like devastating for you. Um, let's see what else we do here. Eight of swords here. We got eight, eight. Yeah, um, you were kind of stuck in a low vibration for a little bit. It wasn't long, but you still, you did have to build up your vibration after this heartbreak or deception, whatever the hell went on here. Two of Pentacles, yeah. Just the thought of you being juggled, knowing how much you loved and cared for this person, it, it really hurt you. And I don't know, um, let me see here. Knight of Pentacles and the Ten of Wands. It was like a slow betrayal too. You're slowly dropping the burden here or you were slow to, because it was heartbreak here. Um, and I feel like you didn't expect this person to do this to you. That's why I kind of feel like it was some outside shit here. Um, justice is here because this was unjust for you. This person, I don't, I'm feeling, I'm feeling spell work here. I feel like there's a karmic energy here that did this to this person. We have the King of Pentacles here. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and we have the full Aries energy. Justice is Libra. There's regret here. I feel like this person was pulled in another direction. Queen of Wands in reverse. Of course they were. There's a fucking witch here. I knew it was something. Somebody paid somebody to do spell work on this person. Or this person went towards a witch. Or a warlock energy here. This person went towards a karmic. The queen of wands in reverse is... They have like no morals. They're very sexual. Um, loose. Flirtatious. This person could use their looks to get things, use their body to get things. 
nine of swords this person regret regrets this that's why they're still holding on to you but it's like move bitch get out the way because we're in my ludicrous voice because there's somebody else trying to come in this person has so much adversity trying to get to you i hope they can get through this shit in the spiritual realm for it to manifest here in the 3d yeah this person is fending and fighting off energies to get to you there's a a soulmate trying to come in a high level soulmate and they're going through hell to get to you more on this this person nine of pentacles the wheel turning in reverse somebody's independence got snatched from them it was judgment for this to happen Somebody can't stand on their own two feet at this time. And I feel like it's this person. Yeah. Everything they touch goes to shit with the five of cups. It's like every opportunity they feel they're getting, it just goes down the drain. Yep. Empress in reverse. They can't manifest nothing. Nothing is growing for this person. This person can't. Make a dollar out of 15 cents. This person, this person is, this is terrible. Meanwhile, they still holding on to you, the tower. There's some divine intervention coming here for this person because they have to let you go. Sorry. And they need to move out the way because whoever's trying to come towards you is not playing. They're sitting here um, annihilating other <laughs> energies to get to you. The Six of Swords here. The tower is for somebody to be lost. This person, I feel like they can't find their way out the darkness. The Nine of Cups here. Um, let me see what's after the Nine of Cups. This person is in complete darkness here. High priestess, as I say that. Seven of swords. This person is taking an opportunity away from you being in the way. A commitment's trying to come in with the four of wands. It could be with a king of wands, an Aries Leo Sag. This person, look at the lion with him. This person is going through hell to get to you. I'm going to say it just like that. There's blockages. There's people in the way. There's energies in the way. And this is just in the spiritual realm. This, is, this hasn't even manifested here yet. Look at this. As I'm saying that, the lovers. There's a King of Wands energy. Still could be a woman. She's just in King of Wands energy. She's in a warrior spirit. If it's a woman fighting to get to a masculine energy. To bring commitment here. Look. Commitment, King of Wands, the lovers. It's a high level soulmate. I, I don't, this is terrible. The Four of Pentacles in reverse. I sure hope this doesn't turn into a missed opportunity here. The King of Cups kind of flipped in reverse. Missed opportunity in love here. This person's trying to get to you with the Seven of Swords, but you can see here, there's a web holding their feet. You could tell they're going through something. They have a bow and arrow on their back, trying to get to the motorcycle. There's a vulture flying over them. Just to plant seeds with you, the seven of cup, the seven of pentacles and the two of cups. It needs to manifest here with the eight of wands. I don't know if you're getting like epiphanies to protect yourself or to do some type of protection here 
And I feel like it's more so in like your dream state because that's when all of this is going on in another realm. This person wants to come in and give you the love you deserve or peep the next card. <clears throat> they can't. There's too much competition and all this background shit going on in the spiritual realm. It's trying to manifest here, but there's people that don't want this to come in for you. Yep, look. Options and heartbreak. And the damn hangman. Oh my God, the love this person has for you. It, it, it's not even, this person hasn't even come into your life yet. But they, I feel so sad. <laughs> This person is going through it. And they want the same thing as you. They want you. I'm about to cry. This is how, you know how, like, um, like, you have a knowing that you are connected to somebody. And you know this person's going to come towards you. But you don't know what this person has to go through to get to you. This is this type of situation. Because there's no ordinary love here. You had that with a past person too. But that contract got voided. That person fumbled. Um, but this person. They're trying. And they have their own battles to fight. In the 3D. This person is going through stuff. In their own life. But it's like. It's, a, it's their mission to connect with you. It's a contract that you have with this person. And your ancestors and them are trying to help this person too. No. Hold on, y'all. No. No. Shh. Let me see. Yeah, like I said, having a knowing. It's like you just waiting to meet your person. And this person is trying. They got this freaking past person that effed up and still holding on to your energy this person have to go look at this a past person the six of cups the ten of cups three of cups i mean three of pentacles and the strength card this person this person is using every fiber of their being to get to you with the strength card it could be a leo but there's a past person that's blocking this Ten of Cups here and outside people. It's like third parties here. These could be people working together to keep you from coming into union with your person. Because in the spiritual realm, I don't know. I astro project. I go to other realms when I'm sleeping. And I be going through. It be like I'm a superhero. <laughs> I don't know if other people relate to this. I be going through so much battles and I'm just like, what is this? That's what this person is going through. They going through so much to get to you. So it can manifest here. But with the Queen of Cups in reverse, there's people that don't want you in a union. I don't know who these people are. Look at him. Look at how he's trying to come in as with the chariot car. This person's trying to come in quickly because they don't want this to be a missed opportunity with you. So know there's new love coming. Yep, Hierophant. This is a spiritual union here that's trying to manifest. I don't know if you're dreaming of being with a person. This It could be your person, but you're dreaming about them before they come in the 3D and connect with you. Yes, watching. This person is trying to connect with you in other realms too, telepathically with the Hierophant and the Page of Wands. That could be the knowing that wish fulfillment is coming in. But this person is squashed. They like, this shit don't make no sense. This don't make no sense. This person out here is slaying stuff in the other realm to get to you. People specifically. Energies. What flipped here? As I say energies, the devil. There's a spiritual warfare for your love here. 
this like in the ethers and other realms it, it is people are battling this person for the ten of pentacles with you there's other new in the ace of pentacles and the ace of swords there is ooh, you want to get the clarity you could be dreaming about this person It is, this is a, a special relationship here. I, I expect that twin flame card to come out. I'm going to use this deck because this deck gives me the nitty gritty on, on what's going on. I like this deck. It's one of my new decks. Um, I have to order some more, but... Um, this person is this King of Wands energy. Let me clarify him. Can I have more on the King of Wands for the collective? Queen of Wands in reverse. Yeah. Hold on. I had the deck upside down, y'all. Oh, no, no. It's every which way. God damn it. Okay, now it's right. So there's people trying to stop this person from getting towards, coming towards you. You're in reverse next to him. So there's definitely battles and there's some serious shit going on in, in other realms for your love. Tower. Yup. Damn. Nine of Cups. Mm. This person is very confident. That's why they going at this shit. Like, I'm going to make it to my queen of cups. The love. this It's the love for you that is keeping this person going. Wish fulfillment. The star. Oh, my God. These cards are speaking. Judgment. There's a battle going on. You see how the angel in the sky is blowing the trumpet, waking up mummies. I'm telling you, they're signaling to help this person. You got passed on loved ones waking up. Like, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> I'm sorry. They just like, what? They just hear this big ass siren going off with this angel. And they just like, what is going on? Ooh. Oh, you trying to get this love to my baby? My, my, yeah. Yeah, this person is a, a king of wands emperor energy. Baby, shh. So, yeah, this, look, this person is royalty. This is a warrior spirit here. This person can lead, probably army. That's why they wake up past on loved ones. Like, look now, y'all been sleeping too long. This person is trying to put burdens down to come towards you with the Ace of Cups. A new beginning in life. And you're totally oblivious to what's going on here. Yeah, there's people trying to take this opportunity away with the seven of swords or energies. Chariot here. This person is coming in quickly. This forward movement here. Ace of Wands. Shh. Okay, baby, you have to wait. We have about the, you want to play the game when I'm trying to do the... Yeah, look at the seven of wands fending off people. This person is giving. This person, yeah, this person's gonna be a giver. The skills will be balanced here with the justice card and the lovers. It's just taking time. I hope this person could get through this. The three of pentacles in reverse. That's my rituals card. There's nothing stopping this. The eight of cups in reverse. There's no walking away. This person is dedicated to this mission and they're not playing the sun card. It could be a Leo. This person is not playing. This person is just gone. <laughs> Temperance, this person is the earth angel too. This person, my God, this person is the bomb. The collective, y'all got some, 
beautiful energies coming towards y'all. These unions that are trying to um, manifest in the 3D are beautiful. It's a lot of adversity against these um, unions coming in. There's a lot of entities and energies trying to keep this from happening because look at the energy that you both will have with each other and individually. The Six of Wands recognition in the spiritual realm, this person is favorable. This is a very, this person is, lo is loved in the spiritual realm. You are too. And this person, when they when you finally meet them, they're going to be very protective. And you're going to be like, why the hell does this person act like this? It's because of what they had to go through to get to you. They know the adversity. They know what's against the odds that are against your relationship. Go listen to that shot in the song. And she has the nerve to have, there's a playlist of, up here. I don't believe this playlist. It's her, the best of Sade. I'm just going to read some of the songs. By Your Side, Hang On To Your Love, Your Love Is King, Kiss Of Life, Fear, Jezebel, um, Haunt Me, Your Love Is King. Oh, they're repeating it. That's confirmation here, those songs. And then we have the Two of Cups here. And options, Seven of Cups was in reverse. This is your person trying to come in here. Knight of Pentacles is smooth and slow because of the trials and tribulations this person is going through. Five of Swords here. Yeah, competition, conflict battles oh can i have something on this um where the hell is that person at this past person he was a king of pentacles yeah because this person is one of the major things that gotta get justice served to them here one of the major energies more on this king of pentacles you messed up go ahead on please Four wands. Look at this. Now they want commitment. Page of Pentacles. Now they want to give more than a page. It's in reverse. Now they got something to offer you. After going towards a Jezebel, as I said. Look at that playlist. The best of Sade. Greatest hits. Full album 2022. Ace of Pentacles, a new beginning. But this mofo is still attached to the damn devil. You see what I'm saying? This is just, this person is a blockage. This person needs to be slayed in the spiritual realm. I hate to say it like that. But they got to go. King of Pentacles, clarifying the King of Pentacles. This person's sitting down. Get your lazy ass up. There's a damn battle coming. <laughs> Keep playing with this King of Pentacles. Um, King of Wands, King of Pentacles. Let's see. He's sitting like he don't know what's coming for him. Page of Swords. He's not, he doesn't see it coming. This King of Wands is nothing to play with. This person's going to sneak him. <laughs> he got to go by any means necessary. The Eight of Wands. He's just going to be sitting there and all these damn arrows is going to shoot at his ass. I'm telling you. <laughs> King of Swords at the bottom. He got to go. He got to be cut out. Heartbreak. Yeah, there's heartbreak attached to this person. Six of Swords. Yeah, they want to sail away with you. Man, you look at a battle going on. It's, it's battle coming towards this person. You want it, you going to get it. You're blocking the divine union here. Move your ass out the way. 
page of wands in reverse. I don't know what I'm getting from that card. Four of Pentacles. This person has nothing to offer an Empress energy. Nothing. But endings with the death card. This is this person. Keep playing. I told you he's going to slay him in the spiritual realm. We got the damn death card here. And look at the Knight of Swords coming in. Oh, God. Oh, my God. This reader is funny. Oh, my goodness. It's going to be a victory here. Your person is going to get through all these battles. They might look worn out. <laughs> and don't judge a book by the cover when this king of wands come in. They done been through some shit. They might look like they've been ragtag. We got three of cups in reverse. I told you there's no victory for this person. Celebration is in reverse. Ten of Wands. They're trying to put burdens down and be stuck to you. They want you to carry them ships. It's in reverse. There's no fool in reverse. This person, before they can actually take a leap of faith towards you, it's going to be stopped. The fool card is in reverse. This person is a clown, too. They see you as the queen of pentacles because you have um, stability attached to you. Your bloodline has wealth attached to it. And that's why this person's coming in. Yeah, because they in the depths of hell with the hermit card. Look at what it... I said this person was in darkness. Look, they're in like a cave with the lantern. And that's all they got in that dark ass cave. I'm telling you cards be confirming they be speaking nine of swords it is stressing this person out this person could wear uh, a bonnet when they sleep with all this hair i understand why i can understand that but it's hidden that this king of wands is a hierophant energy this person is nothing to play with and this is the type of person you have to have with all this adversity against you having love in your life. You need somebody strong. Page of Cups. This person might come back with an apology. And here you are, High Priestess. I'm right. This is this King of Wands energy. This person could lead. Look at how this person... This person could have like an Egyptian... Past could have been an Egyptian in a, a past life, and you too. That's giving me Cleopatra and like Egyptian vibes or leader. Like this person definitely is an emperor in the game. Emperor Hierophant, King of Wands. This person is love. I told you in the spiritual realm, they love this King of Wands energy. They waking up your past on loved ones. Like, look. We got some shit to handle here. The magician. They have all the tools to get this shit done. The will and the will of fortune in reverse. If there's people trying to keep the will from turning here. The world, but that's closing out. It's happening regardless. Two of swords here. Brown feathers. I don't know if you've been seeing feathers. This person might try to pull a wool over your head or try to keep you from seeing their true intentions for you. And it's bullshit. Whatever they coming with. Three of wands here. This person is still connected to that Jezebel karmic energy. The hangman. This person will be left out. They'll be left hanging. And ain't nothing they could do about it. Eight of Pentacles working hard. Let me get this deck here and see what I pull. This is this reading is. Ooh, I like these kind of readings where they go deep. Um
What else does the collective need to know here about this union? Oh, hold on, y'all. That was the deck was in reverse. What else does the collective need to know about this union coming in? Sun strength empowerment. I feel like this this is giving me Leo energy. This person has Leo in their chart somewhere. But the sun strength and empowerment. This person is strong. I heard strength in numbers. This person has a lot of backing. Look what came out. Change and courage. This person is courageous here. They're going, man, look. Put some respect on this person's name. They're not bound to anything toxic or any toxic patterns. It's in reverse. Lack and doubt. Be careful with that, with the lack and doubt energy, because I feel like that's the collective. Travel messages and communication. This person is traveling towards you. Epiphany and breakthrough. Celebration gifts and abundance. It's going to be revealed to you who's um, trying to keep your abundance and celebration from coming in. And it flipped. I knew it was coming. Twin flame. Man. Remember and awaken it in reverse. You might have a past life with this person that you don't remember. When this person comes in, they're going to trigger it. It's going to open up your mind because of the bond that you will have with this person. You're going to recognize them um, when they come in. It's going to take time, though, because remember, an awakening is in reverse. We have external third parties um, interfering. I thought my lady was doing that. Yeah, trying to interfere with your commitment that's coming in and your contract. Because you have a, a new contract with this person. Apology and forgiveness. I feel like the spirit realm don't want no apology from these people. They don't feel sorry for these people. Yep, ego, vanity, and pride. Because these are, these are energies that won't move out the way. Past people. Um, dark entities. They just, they're not knowing to make the decision to let go of these control tactics that they have that interfere in the spirit realm. They don't even want this person to get to you. They're trying to stop it before it manifests. Guarded vulnerability. They could make you feel like you should be guarded when this person comes in. That's why I said be careful with the lack and doubt here, but your ancestors are in the building. They're trying to open up your third eye. They're trying to give you clarity of who this person is when they come in. Yep. So the offer that you get from this person won't trigger you and cause conflict and disharmony. Or this person is going through a lot of conflict to bring this offer to you. Divine timing and trust is in reverse. Transcendence and unity and regret and repression. These people are trying to um, stop divine time and divine intervention, but it's coming regardless. Baby, chill out. Rebirth in winter. Self care and energy. Yeah, I remember I said about protecting your energy. There's something that you need to do that help that can help your um, twin or your life partner that's trying to come in. And remember I said messages in the dream state? This is when all of this shit is going on. When the skills are being balanced and justice is being served. This this um this twin is slaying some karmic energies here, specifically a king of pentacles energy. Somebody where their contract was void or they was a fake ass twin flame. We have distance, retreat, timeout. Yep. Remember I said about the past life? Memories and nostalgia. It's going to give you the truth. 
once you remember who this person you've been with this person before that's why they fighting so hard to get to you it probably was stopped before with um assistance from spirit guides this didn't something in the past life didn't come to fruition with your relationship with this person it was stopped in some way and this person is not letting that shit happen this lifetime they had to release surrender or purge from you in a reunion and soul ties this is a past life um connection here on top of being a twin or a life partner or a high level soulmate here you had to release each other in a past life oh my god chemistry passion in reverse and then we got nurture and compassion Something, somebody was like, it might have been, um, what is that called? Hold on, y'all. I forgot the word that is called when re, in requited love, in requited love. I forgot what it's called, y'all. I'm so sorry. But y'all get my drift. It might have been that in a past life and somebody released the other person. And this is why this person's fighting teeth and nails to get to you this lifetime. This is beautiful. I love past life readings. Yeah. Separation and longing. Oh my God. Oh past lack and suffering in reverse this lifetime you will be together this lifetime we have higher self and activation renewal and spark oh my goodness something flipped y'all you will step into your purpose with this person i said you have a mission to be with this person this lifetime so it's beautiful that that other person avoided their contract because that wasn't your twin or your life partner. That was somebody in the fucking way. Self-worth and expectations here. Masculine in reverse. Yeah, this past person was not divine. Detachment and cold. Or well, this person in the past life wasn't divine. There was um irrequited love here in a past life. It ain't no damn war. We got attraction, hot and Mars. Oops. We got Earth sign. Um, hold on. There's a bunch of cards here. Wait a minute. See, this Earth sign is King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. They're in their um South Node. No, and they're clinging to you. Like, get your ass out of here. <laughs> Present, abundant, and gratitude. Transformation, Pluto. It's over. Guilt and sabotage. We have a um a King of Cups, a Queen of Cups energy, a, P a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, water sign. Um, this person is in regret. Is that regret? No, this person sabotaged. So this is another past person that sabotaged uh, opportunity with you. And now this person ready to take action to come towards you with a new beginning. Try again, muddy fuck all, because we have fate detours and divine intervention. This person is not in coming with no courage. It don't matter what kind of courage you have. Uh, it's not happening. They will be hit with a detour due to divine intervention. We have an ear sign here that's the distorted feminine. That's this karmic energy attached to this king of pentacles. The one they left you for, the Jezebel. This person is distorted. It's a it's an ear sign. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. What about this bitch? Tower for you. What's the tower? Avoidance and stalemate. She know not to play with you. Yeah, this person might have left you in the spring. She, this karmic energy planted seeds with this King of Pentacles in the spring. 
growth and so on. You ascend to past these people by healing your inner child. And now here's your King of Wands energy. Fire sign, gang, gang. Aries, Leo, Sag. Look at this shit. Family, home, and commitment. Jawari, stop. Stop, Jawari. Sorry, y'all. Look, wish fulfillment. Woo oh my God, I love these past life readings and the spiritual realm stuff. When they get deep, I love this. Open to receive. I hope you're ready and open when this person comes because they didn't been through hell and hot water to get to you. Yeah, don't do this. Collective, close off garden and resistance. Don't do that because of facades and beliefs. Your belief system. Mm -mm. Drop it because you got a union coming. This is crazy. <laughs> this shit is like a movie. Oh my goodness. These tactics of confusion and illusions, these entities and past people using in the spiritual realm to try to deceive you and tempt you, that cycle is closing out. It's over. They can keep on watching. You can watch all you want. Take notes too. It might help you get out of your shadow side. Keep watching the collective. You might learn a thing or two on how to be a better person and transform. They'll just wind up isolating themselves, going into hiding. Because they'll know you, your union can't be touched once this person comes in the 3D. Last card, freedom. Yep, you'll be set free. Obviously, your person's slaying these people. What are they going to do? And they didn't woke up yet. Angels and blew the trumpet and woke up your past loved ones. They like, God damn, I was sleeping good. What is going on here? Like, what, what is the problem? They are irritated. Your spirit family is irritated. Because there's no reason for this. Let people be happy and be loved by the people they need to be loved by. And want to be loved by. There, there's people in the collective that wants love. They're open to receive it. And it's like it can't come in all these obstacles. And it's going on in the spiritual realm. So imagine the adversity when this person, you and this person come into union. You have to be prepared for that. Let me get some cards here. And I'm going to let y'all go. Freedom is coming. It is coming. I think freedom was the last card. And then we just saw it. That's beautiful. Empathy at the bottom. Trust. Trust in divine time and your person's coming. No doubts here. Ooh, excuse me, y'all. Look, adversity. I'm telling you. This is giving me lighthouse, like light is coming from, I mean, they blowing a trumpet. They didn't turn, they made the lighthouse go off. It's a war going on for your love here. This is beautiful. Pride in reverse. This person is the bomb, but they not gonna come, they're not prideful. This is a humble person. Love. love. I never knew what I was missing, but I knew once we started kissing, I found that note is woo. I found you. Change. judgment make a decision <laughs> you could be feeling like this shit is just in your head or it's your imagination or you're just dreaming and it's this person trying to show themselves and this in your dream state look courage 
Oh my goodness, empathy. Oh my god, this person's gonna be so attentive to your needs. We have abundance. I told you this person is royalty. There's wealth connected to you and this person. We have indecision. Don't be indecisive. It's what you deserve here. Friendship. This person is going to be your friend and your lover. Your person. Your, your rock. Your ride or die. Perseverance. This person is going to keep fighting until they get to you. There was this person is very disciplined. I told you they could lead an army um, and might have in the past. This um, this past life, I'm going to pull a card to find out what happened. I'm being told to. More for the collective. This is beautiful. Service. Mm. Ooh, I'm getting an overwhelming feeling to cry again. This person. Because people, some people don't make it in the spiritual realm. I'm going to tell y'all a story. I hope I don't cry. So, there was a man that, um, I might cry, y'all. <laughs> there was a man that, um, I had a, a the biggest crush on oh my god so um he he reminds me of this energy now thinking about it he was tall he was fine he had a lot of money he was just he was a sweetheart he had a lot of women that liked him i mean a lot um but anyway um we were talking and then he came to my birthday party. I had a birthday party in the club. But when I saw him, I couldn't say anything. He didn't see me, but I was like a creep. Because <laughs> first of all, I'm shocked that he came. So I'm like in awe. And then um, he was like, his energy was just too much to the point. And I'm very confident. I was afraid of him. It was like afraid to approach him. But he came to see me, so it didn't make sense. But that was how his demeanor was and his energy was. It was very, like, bright. And it was just like, I don't know how to explain it. Anyway, so that was a missed opportunity for me. Seven years later, we reconnect again. Um, So he started, like, posting things about, like, twin flames and and relationships and meeting his person and blah 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 so i'm like oh that's sweet so um let me see what happened we were supposed to meet and this is this is why to it letting opportunities pass you by thinking you'll get it again i had that mentality so i was supposed to go meet him and then i was he lived in new york and i live in pennsylvania so I was supposed to meet him and um, I told him, I said, um, I can't come. He said, that's fine. He said, um, we'll have plenty of other opportunities to meet each other, to link up, to spend time with each other. Do you know he died the next day? In a car accident, he died. I was devastated when I say devastated oh my god and it was like it was always like it was almost like eerie like he knew he was gonna pass and I took it as um I got the opportunity to say goodbye before he was gone I got the opportunity to connect with him before he said goodbye but this is what I'm getting like some past life situation where something happened here and you didn't come into union and this person is fighting to be with you and actually I skipped the part that I dreamed of him fighting somebody that I was with at the time and he kept saying are you with this person and I'm like no even though I was but because I went to be with him I'm in the dream state lying to him like no 
I'm not what he kept saying. Or he had a physical fight with this person in the dream. And he kept saying, are you with this person? And I'm like, no. And then he passed away. I could not believe it. I couldn't believe it. Because in the dream, the person he was fighting, he walked away and his nose was bleeding. And my uh, mom was screaming like, he's out here fighting, trying to tell me that my crush was outside fighting the person that I was with at the time. And he died in a car accident two days after I had that dream. And one day after I told him that I couldn't come see him. So stuff in the 3D and the spiritual realm, it, it manifests in real life. He was fighting to be with me and then he died. I was like, I can't believe this. Devastated. So I'm going to find out what happened to you and your person. But we have growth here and freedom. You will be set free from this. Whatever this 3D realm shit is going on. But let me just pull a card. Can you tell me um can you tell me what happened with the collective in the past life with this person? With this twin trying to come in. What happened in the past life? Sorry I rambled on, but I just wanted to give you an example of how shit does manifest in the spiritual realm and don't resist this person when they come in because they're going through a lot to be with you and i feel like a past life it didn't work out we got justice here in the night of wands um what happened in the past life hold on i didn't really ask two of wands flipped out what happened in the past life okay we have the seven of pentacles we have the devil here we have the magician and the ten of wands Did somebody convince this person that in planting seeds with you was too much of a burden? There's this person, it was irrequited love here because somebody convinced this person that you were too much to, yeah, magic. Eight of Pentacles. There was magic. We got the devil, the high priestess, and the Eight of Pentacles. Page of Wands, Chariot. This person could have went towards a lusty energy. With the Chariot not knowing which way to go. This person went towards someone else. Yep. Yeah? Six of Pentacles they gave to someone else. And then you got, you wind up in the same situation with somebody else this lifetime. But now this person is ready for, they realize who you are with the Empress. They're not going to give to anybody else. With the Four of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords. This opportunity in the past life was taken from you with the Seven of Swords. That is why the trumpet is being blown here. It's not happening this time. There was magic before. Yep, yeah, it ended in heartbreak. Look at this shit. Oh my God. Temperance because in reverse because of devil energy. Look at the story this is telling. The lovers... Oh my goodness, more on the past life, more on the past life with this person, two of swords, there was, this person was blinded to who you were, there's a blindfold on her eye, and it caused them to walk away from you, it was magic here, look at his energy, king of wands flying out, wish fulfillment oh my goodness here more on the past life knight of swords magician spell work queen of fucking pentacles libra gemini aquarius what did we get about it of the earth sign here go back and see what we said about the earth sign i got 50 cards out here i can't see we have the Nine of Pentacles, 
and the three of cups. There was a jealous person here. They were jealous of your independence and the relationship you had with this person. They celebrated causing destruction here with the five of swords and they have help. This is this past life situation and it's fucking king of pentacles again. This person could have been an option to you too in a past life. Because I'm asking about the past life here. Or this king of pentacles is trying to cause havoc here and present themselves as an option to you with the knight of pentacles and the six of swords. It's just to take this opportunity away from you again. Five of cups and have you crying over spill milk. There's people trying to stop this relation, this union again. Judgment is here though, because it's going to happen regardless with the ace of cups. And the tower will hit these motherfuckers when this ten of pentacles come in with the two of cups. It's happening regardless. A brand new beginning in love, the ace of pentacles, and the four of wands. There will be a union and commitment this lifetime. Something fell. Queen of cups. Love. It can't be stopped. Ain't no mountain high enough to keep me from you. Ain't no mountain high enough. Six of Cups is happening. You're being gifted this union, this lifetime. You could have a spiritual baby here, a girl, a daughter. This is beautiful. Hangman. Queen of Wands. Remember you were in reverse. You're up right now. This union is happening regardless. Yep, after some cycles close out here, you will be rewarded. Two of Wands. Oh my God, this is beautiful. I'm gonna end it here, y'all. You have a beautiful union coming here. It's worth fighting for. This person is trying and they're gonna succeed. They're going to succeed here. Um, won't be a maybe next lifetime with this. You guys are going to come into union. And it's going to be like an instant attraction or bond. Because you're going to feel like you know this person. Because you do. You had a past life with this person. And maybe with that king of pentacles and that karmic that they're attached to. Because energies can follow you in different lifetimes. I feel like this King of Pentacles came back again with some bullshit and the karmic Jezebel energy and all these other entities trying to stop this shit because there's multiple things going on in the realms. That's why it's a war. It's a war going on outside. No man is safe from. It's, it's, it's a war here for your love. This person, this is beautiful. Don't, pop, don't pass up this opportunity. And you'll know when a person comes in because you feel like they'll, it'll be a knowing. You'll feel like you've been with this person before. Don't do like me. <laughs> don't think you have another opportunity and you pass up on this. I regret it big time. <laughs> I really regret it. But I'm happy with who I'm with, of course. But, um, uh, I understand that it was a missed opportunity. Maybe next lifetime for me with him. We'll see. But I'm happy with who I'm with. So, Whew, this almost got me emotional. Yeah, I'm going to really, I'm going to watch this a couple times. I like past life readings and I don't get them all the time. Um, listen to Sade's song um, and just. Make sure you pay attention to the signs and synchronicities that you get before this person comes in. Because they're going to kind of try to let you know who it is. You might, like I said, dream about the person before they come in. So just be on the lookout. Um, I send my love and light to y'all. Like, subscribe, comment, share. Join the Spiritually Yours family. I would love to have you. We are really growing in numbers. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My family is getting bigger and bigger. 
Um, but till next time, y'all. Later.